everyone you're welcome back to my channel it's another great day thank you for joining me today this is your first time of being here you're welcome i appreciate you from the places where you're watching me from and uh if this is your first time like i said before and you really love what we do or you've never checked out what we do at all just go head to our channel and see what we do if this is what you love because mostly we share on motherhood kids um you know topic that relates to you know um, parenting okay so that's what we do your family of those stuff that's what we do here if you love it please don't forget to subscribe and hit on the bell that bell sh and shows that we already have new content and if you not like please like this video because that's the only way you can encourage me okay we don't ask for any funding all right you just like in our videos right okay and also share share to loved ones and family so we're going to get back right to you because you already know we're going to be sharing today okay I'm just gonna say it. So you're welcome back. Like I said before, you already know what we're gonna be sharing today, and it's all about breastfeeding. You know, I already did um, two episodes, so today we're gonna be talking about um, hand expression on this video. And um, what I want to really say here before I, I show you um, how practically you do hand expression is if you are here to uh, learn, all right, especially. Um, people that really benefit from this video are mothers and also fathers okay because sometimes it's also um, very um, useful that the um, fathers assist the mothers especially when they don't have strength or they're just newly put to bed of that baby so they need the assistance of the father okay so they're the one that uh, this video is all about okay so it's an educational video that has to do with the breathing of babies and mother what they pass through okay and one of them is this um, hand expression all right so um if this uh, really um you want to learn more you have to go for that to read hand expression is where you use your artificial way of expressing a milk and milk we're talking about is breast milk okay and the reason i feel is just more or less expensive more or less expensive than pumping because you know you have to go around and um you know buy a breast um pump Okay, to do that it's not everybody that can afford that i know it's very very affordable but it's not everybody that can afford that you understand especially those that stays in the rural areas like the place i'm from like africa okay it's not mothers especially when you have you already have one or two or three or there are about more kids okay and the one that you just had you just didn't need to do those things about though like the ones you already used before you can also use for the um you know your present baby okay so the reason why for me i feel is just because it's more and less expensive okay and also it's manageable for you to do that okay and i'm going to be showing you how hand expression how it's so like i said before just for mothers and they're the one that will find this more useful because they already have the, the breast i'm talking about so this is just it so if you want to hand express what you have to do is just to make your hand like a cup if you don't know how to set your hands to look like a c-shape a c-shape you can use your um your feeding bottle what you use to breastfeed the baby like what i'm talking about is where you store your milk your artificial milk if that's what you, you give to your baby or your uh, breast milk where you store it so you use the water bottle or a bottle shape okay especially this feeding bottle the one you use for babies you just have to set it on the table the place that will be easier for you to demonstrate this you know um shape of a c when you go close, I don't have a bottle right now, but I think you understand better, right? So when you go and, uh, you know, like you put the bottle already on the table, you, you make a C-shape out of it. It's just the bottle, you know, the bottle is, is, is just a straight, um, you know, straight uh, curved uh, shape, okay? Straight shape, okay? So you make a C shape out of that bottle and you just take it from that, your, uh, from the water bottle, like your, your hands exactly from just from the bottle and face immediately to your breast. You see what I'm doing right now? There is nothing to be shy about it. The men that are here to also watch this video, you know, you already have mother, yet you have mother and you breastfed from your mother, okay? So, men and women also benefit, or they don't know what I'll be talking about today, right? So, you just have to do your hands on C shape and just like this, okay? So when you set your hands like this, like a C-shape, it should be the C-shape. The C-shape is derived from the bottle where you're about to make that, you know, so that it will be appropriately, you know, give you the the, fig, um, the, the the angle that you want, okay? So you set it on your breast and you start, you know, just start. People I'm talking about are just people that just live, up, um, you know, put to bed of their baby. They just newly born babies, mothers that just you know they just had their babies because you know the reason why we do hand expression there are some that love doing that some they go into pumping is just because it's easier for you to because you know cholesterol is very very difficult to you know to express cholesterol is very very because it's very very thick and it's, you know the cholesterol is the first 
breast milk that babies have and colostrum really help helps a lot it helps the psychological uh, of, of the effect of the baby it helps when especially when the baby is just arrived and also it gives it has a whole lot of nutrients you know milk itself has a whole lot of calcium okay so the colostrum is very very needful like i said before the colostrum itself is very very thick because you just go to bed okay so you just have to set your hands like this like a c shape and you just start like this you start you know pressing this way make sure you go round, <coughs> but make sure now that C shape that you got from your water bottle that you are getting your, your angle from is just, you know, standard, alright? So that you don't go off the shape. You just start this way. And when you're done with this part, make sure every single lump of it, you know, just make sure you press, you press, you press. When you're done with that, you come to this direction like this, okay? So you start this way, this way, this way. You start pressing, pressing, and you have to look for a place like a bottle where you store the breast milk as well. As you're pressing it, you just fix a bottle there, and the breast milk will just be dropping there in the bottle. So that's just what to do when you finish with this shape. But make sure you maintain your C-shaped, um, you know, the angle that you're using, okay, for the breast. So you have to start, you know, when you're done with this side of the shape, you go back again like this. This is what you will do to you express enough. Like I said uh, when I started... You know, um, when you just have the baby, it's so difficult for the breast milk to just start coming immediately. Even if I thought you already have babies already, like before you start like breastfeeding again for the new baby, you still have to go through, especially if you want to uh, continue doing this hand expression, okay? Hand expression for those that have gone through, they really know that it's much more, more efficient, like it's more efficient because pumping itself cannot bring out the colostrum. The first breast milk you give to babies it doesn't bring out the colostrum because colostrum is just thick okay all right so we know that during pregnancy it takes nine months for uh, the breast milk to form and when you are breastfeeding the baby uh, everything is already like intact like it's so thick so you need your hand to express everything out and the reason why uh, some mothers somehow uh, they are finding this so difficult to you know, to do this pumping or whatever what or the benefit or the importance of hand expression is because it's really going to help the breast to pump enough milk if you do it constantly, I know it's, it's you know somehow painful, especially when you just put to bed. It's, it's, it's somehow painful, okay? But those that have not expressed this, they, they will tell you. For those that have expressed this, they will tell you that it's really painful when you breastfeed for the very first time when you just have a baby, okay? Because you might just be so tired, you just tired all the like hours and you know um, uh, minutes and hours, okay, of labor. You know the stress it takes you before the baby comes out. So. Some mothers usually find it so tiring, so like they're just so fed up. How is it breast milk that we can? I'm going to be doing immediately. I just put a pen. So some mothers don't go for that and like you know just expressing milk immediately. Why? Because they are just be, like they are being fat out. Another reason might just because uh, the baby maybe the baby some had um, some kind of um, complication. Why they why they brought out the baby from the womb or when the baby was birth. Maybe there's some kind of um you know um complications okay so the baby might just be kept somewhere in the uh, pre-care where it can be they can examine the baby on a further so the mother may not have chance to see the baby immediately so it depends on what happened or the complication or whatever that happened why as she put to bed so that gap it might take it all depends it might take some days it all depends on the complication um uh, complicated issue that like the baby had all right why um the doctors brought the baby out okay so the mother may not have the chance to see the baby meet lately so but if uh, you really want enough of this person you have to be doing it constantly this is just what you should know you have to be doing it constantly even if i thought the baby is not in your hands immediately just continue doing it, just like an essay that keep doing it when the baby arrives immediately and they are done with um, checking of um, every um you know, thing on, on the baby's body and everything is uh, certified okay you can take back your baby give back your baby and why you already have done the exercise it's just going to be easy just for you to just put your baby um in the mouth of the breath of the breast and just start feeding the baby so it's easier for the baby to get the first milk which is the colostrum like i told you about colostrum has a whole lot of nutrition and nutritious value for the baby especially baby that you just put to bed okay so that's just what I feel. And also those that uh, did me, they just had um, cesarean oppression uh, because of that. <laughs> you know what? For those that are, are really also have experienced, you know, put into bed of the baby by cesarean, you know, it's tiring. Like, I'm talking about the pains that you experience immediately you, um, 
bring the baby to the world okay the pain you experience it's just it's not something that we can explain love so for mothers that have gone through are uh, putting to bed um and like bringing baby to this world by cesarean they know the pain it it, it takes even if at all they give uh, they've given you painkiller you still have to be feeling the pain immediately the painkiller you know dies down of its effect okay so breastfeeding the baby at that moment difficult okay but our advice before you start um doing hand expression Please, it's better you do it beforehand when you're still pregnant. That is more efficient way of having enough breast milk little baby becomes, okay? When you are pregnant from, like, say, six months, you know, six months is just three months, that is remaining for you to, you know, bring the baby to the world, mature enough for the baby to come. During that six months, make sure you do an exercise of hand expression. Just stay a bit, a little, maybe just give yourself some time and, you know, just on your own, keep doing it. And when you are done with the left one, you go with the right okay so if uh I, when you are breast when you already are like you're put to bed of the baby and you are um, doing hand expression look for a place to store the breast milk maybe it's difficult for the baby because there are some babies that they find it difficult because their mouth is just very tender and uh you know it takes continual i want you to know it takes continual exercise don't feel pity for your baby because if you really want to breastfeed your baby you have to be doing it constantly with him or the bed of her okay so it depends on how consistent you are in doing breast popping or maybe immediately you finished like before you put to bed of the baby you've done exercise like i said and the breast milk have you know really set it's easier for the baby to suck from what you have already the exercise you've already done to you know bring the milk together like i showed you on the exercise i did why or um you do go into hand expression okay so it's easier for the baby to suck out the breast milk okay but one thing i have to assure you before i end this video today hand expression is what you do constantly before you can have an achievable result it's difficult for make breast milk to just you know come out you know you know for those that are mothers they know and those that are fathers they already know that they have wives that if really you are close to your wife you know that she would definitely be complaining to you that breast milk doesn't come immediately so it's, it's just constant thing i know it's not easy because the pain there <laughs> It's so, so outrageous, all right? So you have to be doing it constantly before you be able to achieve that. You know that if you want to, like they always tell us, breast milk is very, very essential for newborn babies, okay? Even if at all you cannot take it up to six months to breastfeed that child, but make sure the first, in fact, the first six months, I know it's not easy, every night to wake in, late night to wake in to breastfeed the baby, and you know, breast milk, like I said, one of my videos, it doesn't fool the baby enough it's not like it can't it can't hold the baby for a long time breast milk is just let me just say just like a uh, normal water maybe take but it helps them it helps their immune system it helps them their bones to be stronger like i said breast milk contains enough and a whole lot of cholesterol okay so if you want to have more educational tips on breast you can also go and google out and search more on what you have to also add to achieve your breast milk but breast milk some tell you that you have to take uh, like in africa where i'm coming for you have to, for those that are africans okay they will tell you that you have to take um what's it called coconut water coconut water to you know to enhance breast milk so i will tell you how to eat a uh, pap for those that don't know how pap it just maize um what you uh, what you extract from maize okay the maize ingredient what you extract from maize yes you there's a way we make it it calls it's called a uh, pap okay when you take it hot it enhances breast milk so whatever case that is the, the one that works for you but the one that's very very essential for me that i have to conclude it in this video just that that um you know hand expression is more cheaper it's more affordable it's more efficient because it's you that is doing it it's, it's, there's nothing there to assist you doing and for those that live in the rural areas for those that you know, maybe they cannot um, they don't have enough electricity okay so it's, it might be somehow difficult for them to because pu a, a pump machine you need electricity to you know to be able to you know to for, for it to work okay so for those that don't have electricity in the past where they are from or getting electricity is so, so difficult for them they can use an expression okay so this is just where i'm going to head the video today i hope you love it and please if you've not subscribed and also i have to add here if there's anything that you want us to also do here in this video please don't hesitate to leave everything there in the comment section and also this video like i said one time like when i said i said one time also i said before i stated uh what i dealt on today is that fathers also have to be of help to them uh, to their wives uh, husbands yes have to be of help to their wives because <laughs> doing that alone is not an easy tell if your wife is there complaining to you that something like this or you know 
or something like that, like when breastfeeding or maybe the, 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 the stress of you know, bringing a newborn baby after stress of bringing a newborn baby is, you know, like it's so hectic. You have to be there for them at every um, stage of the way, okay? So, um, I said if there's anything you want us to also share online, breastfeeding, please leave everything there in the comment section and don't forget to like this video because it's very, very important. Please like this video there is no way you can support me here you don't pay any amount we don't do any patron whatever stuff or paypal stuff that is the only way you can assist me to just like the video and also share because this video is an educational video what people mostly mothers can also learn and those that are about to you know are going to the stage of motherhood to bring babies to this world they will also learn something from this video uh, from this video and if it's your first time mom or you're a first time dad also you also have to learn from this video okay so thank you very much for staying back even up to this moment please subscribe turn on your bell for more videos so love you all see you i'm just gonna say it